hi guys welcome back to the channel make sure you guys like comment and subscribe to the channel make sure your post notification bell is on so you don't miss a video in time is the upload also to like comment and share definitely share this channel make sure you like the video guys like 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 also to your post notification bell on subscribe button gray not red okay we're gonna go ahead and do this video y'all let me tell you y'all know I am known for buying stuff and you know you'll just be done seeing what you be looking for one minute and then when you're not looking for it you can't find it that's where I'm at right now but guess what we're not gonna hold up that video on that we're just gonna go ahead and do the video okay anyway but let me tell you guys about this box today we're working with sticky notes okay our sticky note box I get them from the Dollar Tree this is a Dollar Tree item. I did a Dollar Tree haul on these boxes. And now is the time to go to your local Dollar Tree in your area or either when you're out and about, like I always say, and go shop at somewhere else when you're out and about. Shop their Dollar Tree because they may have a lot of nice stuff that your area does not carry. Now, in my area, we just now begin to get the Dollar Tree Plus. So... And they've been having a whole lot of stuff. But right now, school is just about to start. And they've been putting all kinds of stuff. But today, you know, I told you guys we are going to come back and we was going to do a update on this here box. Okay? If you don't, and uh, how to decorate. Listen, if you don't want to decorate it, leave it like it is. I was looking, by, um, looking for some little mini pins. I did. But I can't find them, y'all. I cannot find them. And that's bad. I don't know where they're at, but anyway, but we're gonna go ahead and decorate anyway. I'm gonna show y'all how to decorate it anyway. You can leave it like it is, and if this here, right here, could be a total whole set. Do you, let me tell you, the only thing I do not like about it, my little pet peeve, I do not like. You know, when you go in the Dollar Tree, sometimes they have when you when they have the little spirals or the little address books. It's a little tab. This here is normally a little tab piece that you can tear off, and you know. And I told you guys, if it's like that, you can basically make it your own, right? But guess what? This one here, on some of them, you will get them like this, where it's already inside. Um, It comes with the box. It's just stuck on there. You can't do anything. And y'all already know, this is a Jot series, okay, that they have. And you can still make this your own, but the only thing you can do, you can get a piece of felt, okay? Get a piece of felt. And put on the back the whole back side of this once it's been decorated just only at the back and then that way when you put it down on your table or anything it's not going to move as much you know like if you just want it to be standard and you don't want it just sliding all over the place or whatever you can do that all right and this is what it looked like on the inside as y'all can see right there and this is a three by three this is a three by three i love it and this little box here do comes up. Like if you have a real, real important message you don't want anybody to see, guess what? You can keep this like it is and put your information there. Just tear it off and put it there. Because you know, just say if you had this on your desk and you don't roll something down. Oh, okay. She planning on doing that. Guess what? Aunt, you know we have nosy sisters and brothers and sisters. Sometimes aunts and uncles. It does not matter. Colleagues or whatever. Guess what? They won't see it if you have it taped down in here. Just stick it in there. But I like these here because they come matching with this, with the pad itself, notepad itself. And also, too, they just like the little um theme that it has going to color things. But let's show you guys how to decorate this box. Make it cute. Make it your own, okay? Also, too, we have the short ones. I love the short ones. And now these here are the ones here you don't have you can really make this here your own now if you don't like this right here because it say memo set pad seven you can just redecorate this whole page or just decorate half half of it right here bling it out or something you can do that just say you just altered it or whatever and it has it has the same thing the little thing these are cute i like that i like that and this one here 
This here is, I guess, the tripod, I guess, or whatever. And I love this one. Look, if y'all remember, we've seen this here before in the, in the um hall. I like this. I'm just fold it like so. I like that. Now, this one here, you can do the same. You can also basically make this one your own as well. You can add a little pin right here. Let me see. Yeah, you can. Well, no. Because it'll be hard to close. You can add, put your little piece of felt or whatever and decorate it in or whatever you decide to put right here to, to add a pin. You can do that as well with this. You can put slip these here down in your purse, your bag, your book bag, you know, whatever. This is, this is a nice one. I forgot how this one even looked. But this is cute. It's more of the little pastel rainbow Easter colors. Put me in the mind of the Easter colors or whatever. But anyway, yeah. So I'm going to turn that back over. We're not going to decorate this. We're not going to decorate this. I'm just going to probably just decorate one just to show you guys how you can decorate this. Okay. And y'all know this mesh bling comes from the Dollar Tree. You can basically look at it and you can see how you want it to look. And you know, on the and then on top of it, look, you can, um, it can come in all different colors. You can basically use all the different colors. Let me see. I can do, uh, I can do that lavender right there. I can do probably this color here. This here darker pink or whatever. Let me see. That'll be cute. Kind of like a pink looking. See there? Y'all see how that look? Let's see. I mean, you can literally just, you can basically go to town on this box. You really can. You really can. Huh. Let's see. Let's see what we can make it look like from being this. Okay. Just from being this regular box. All right in this regular box and let's bring it out right quick I'm going to try not to let this video be long hopefully it's not long you can put it in all different colors I have some light green and I do have the light green you can get these from the Dollar Tree like I said and I have some, I have red, I have all kind of colors this I have gold I have all kind of colors. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see, guys. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. Oh, uh, we're gonna go ahead and cut this off. All right. Get your glue gun and make sure, guys, your glue gun is in a um safe place when you're using your hot glue gun okay oh it's too much it is hot okay that is hot 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 we're gonna uh, hear it right here Let's see what we got. Let's see what we're working with. Y'all know what? Y'all know them little pink things you get from the um Dollar Tree for your hands when you're working with this glue. Y'all know Miss D had bought some, right? That's what it's for. And I'm sitting here wiping it with my hand. Guess what? Miss D ain't finna get up. I'm not getting up. I'm not going to get up, okay? Because I want to say it's over there, but I'm not going to do it because it might not be over there. In my little box. All right. Do enough to get you started. And we're going to bring this all the way out to here, okay? All right. Let's see. Mm. 
Like I say, be very careful with this glue because this glue is hot. Ah. Okay. Let's see. Try to do it like one time if possible. And go down it like so. Mind you me, you will have extra glue on your hands. So that's what it is. That's what it is. Okay. That's what it is. All right. We done did that right. Now, you know you can also decorate the front of this as well. Y'all see those little lines right there? You can get every color and just decorate this box of your little, um, I think I am. Let's see what it'll look like if I add some of the colors and do like a pattern. I could do like a pattern. But in the meantime, I can do this here color. The purple is lavender right here. Let me see. I can do the lavender, go around all around this whole box. Let's see what we could do. I could do. Huh. Let's see. I think I, I'm going to do it like this. Let's see. I think I'm going to do it like this. I'm going to cut off a line, cut it off right here, and I'm going to cut off a line. Because right now I'm working with four. I'm going to make it to three. Let's make it to three, guys. Let's make it to three. So if we don't want the, the box to just look like just the same box. Hmm. I want another one in here. That's what I'm doing. Huh. Okay. I know what I'm going to do. Instead of, instead of doing that, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you guys in just a minute so we can fix a cute little box right quick. Okay. Let's do this so we can fix a cute little box right quick. Okay. That's that. Okay. Let me show you show you guys what we're going to do. But why did you bring it down, Miss D? Because remember, when you open it, you want to still be able to put your hand inside here. You want to still be able to put your hand inside here when you open it like so and be able to get your tabs. I'm fixing to show y'all in just a moment, okay? Y'all, I also got me another little setup on my camera because my lighting was bad. So, if y'all see that my lighting has gotten a little bit better, I had to get me another ring light, guys. I did. So, if y'all see the difference, that's what it is, okay? And I got the one way, the adjustable way you can move it up and down. And if I want y'all to look at it a little closer or something like that. Okay. 
what I do at the end, I always t apply me some heat. I'm not going to put it on here because I don't need YouTube tripping. Uh, Y'all know how I feel about the heat thing. So, there we go. There we go. Now, what we're not going to do, we're not going to do this side with that. Okay, because I don't want to use up all my purple. So, let me see. I'm going to, I'm going to do something different. I'm going to do something different with it, guys. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to go all the way to the edge, though. I want to go all the way to the edge. I'm going to cut it here. And let me see how I like it. Let me see how we like it. And I'm, I think I'm going to do three on this one. Yeah, I'm going to do three. The other one I did four. Or either you, instead of mixing the color, I'm going to do a mixture on this one. To show you guys what I'm talking about. So that way, you can have like a matching theme. Or whatever. You can have like a matching theme. I'm going to go ahead and put some glue here. You can do it like I just did it. Or whatever works for you. That's fine. You can use whatever works for you. However you do it. However you will hear this, it's fine. As long as it gets on there, right? Yeah. As long as it gets on there, Misty. this here because I want it to overlap here and then I'm fixing to show y'all why I did it like this y'all excuse the same noise let me show you guys why I did it like this okay now reason why I did it like this, if y'all can see, it's still, you can't tell the difference if I use the lavender or either the magenta color, right? It look more like a pink looking. Let me show y'all. Y'all see right here where it's overlapping? I got glue everywhere on my hand. Y'all can see where it's look like it's overlapping right here. Right here. When I close it down, watch this. Y'all watch this. Watch this. That's why I want it to overlap. I want it to do that. And I'm fixing to show y'all why. Exactly why I wanted it to do that. But make sure it is down. And it's not coming up. Okay. I'm going to take another little piece of this right here. The magenta kind. More of the magenta color. And get only get only one piece. I'm gonna go ahead and cut it in half. And I'm gonna take only one piece off of here. I don't need but one. Okay, this is the magenta kind. Remember, we used the magenta and the lavender, so we're gonna keep that. But right now, we're working with the magenta. I'm going to take this magenta piece, only one piece, and I'm fixing to adhere it on here in the middle, like so. Okay? Look like a double bling box. But before I do that, in case I have to overlap it this way, let me see. We got this piece for here. Yes, yes. Okay. We have enough on this. About time for another glue stick already. Let's see. Okay. 
we got a bling box sticky note bling box that's what we're doing our sticky note bling box okay make sure this kind of overlaps so it can go around like so all right now we're going to finish gluing going to finish gluing okay we're going to take this bring it right here and go all the way right on like so okay like that like i say at the end i always uh, here put my heat to it to make sure it's definitely on there so i hope y'all can see me gluing this on here Okay, there we go. Now, we done did the sides. Okay. We done did the sides. Now, we're fixing to put this little piece here. Besides me having glue everywhere. We're going to put this little piece here. And we're going to adhere it like this. Like so, like that. Yes, we are. And guess what I'm fixing to do? Instead of putting it on just that one piece, I'm just going to put it right here in the middle that's where I want it to go now if you if you don't want to use the glue you don't have to if you want to use the adhesive you can but I don't like using the adhesive on this unless and I'm fixing to bead it out you know something like that like so okay so whatever works for you at the time you're blinging it out is fine but to me, my hot glue works better for me. Sometimes it could be this sticky piece is already on the back. But to me, that does not, it does not stay on. So that's why if you see me and everybody else, they may use a little hot glue. That's why. But I'm fixing to show y'all. We finished finish blinging out this box. If Miss D can get this here glue off her hand. So, y'all are not focused on the glue. Okay. We're going to go on down. In the center. Stay close to that line as you possibly can, guys. Finish bringing it up like so. And voila, there you have it. Mash it down. And that's it. I wish I had my lighter, but I don't. So, see? If y'all can see, y'all see what I did right there on the corner? So, to come around, if y'all can see on the corner where it came around right here, like I say, at the end, I just put heat to it and so it all be done melted in and so forth. But yeah. Now y'all see what I did? Right there. That's a different color. And at the back. Now, I very well can put another piece back here to match the front. But I'm not going to do that. Okay? Because I wanted to make it look like it was coming around here. if you want to get real fancy with it you can just put your little strip in here or put your little sand in here whatever put your little cute note that say um my sticky notes or whatever or just a little sand anything anything you want but let's see something. So whenever I told y'all we can do this right here, you can curve this here. You see where this lavender at? I can come up here and do this box like so, like this. 
like this to this corner. I can get a green piece and put it like right in here somewhere to go with the swerve. Or I can just leave it like it is, or I can just very well come around the top. Let me see. Let me see. Hold on. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Let's see what we can do right quick. Like I said, I don't want this video to be too long. And let's just do two. Let's just do two. So if I come up here. You can do the whole thing. You can bling out the whole box. But I wouldn't want to bling out the whole box. Would you guys? Would you bling out the whole box? That's cute. I think I can probably like go around the edge. Let me see. Let me see right quick. I think so. Let me see if I did two and two. Let me see right quick if I did two and two, y'all. Okay. This way. I'm going to do it like this so I don't look like I'm taking long with the video. But make sure when you put this glue on. Okay. Like so. Now, what, what I could have did, y'all, y'all see right here, you could leave that like that. Y'all see that gap right here? Take you a another piece of this right here and just go along the line. You can do that. But I'm fixing let me let's just finish. How about that? Let, let's, let's just finish. Okay. Let's just finish. Cut off another piece. Like I said, I don't want this to be too long. So I just want y'all to see what it looks like when I'm doing. Let me see. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's just finish. Whatever you do, make sure you hurry and put it down before your glue dries. Make sure it's in line straight. Let's see with this one. Let's see with this one. I'm still here, y'all. I'm still here. Y'all see me. I'm still here. And also, too, what you can't, like I said, you can't put a pick here or you can leave it like that because you want to see the, um, world on top of it or whatever. Okay. Okay. 
and bring this up close as you can to the edge bring it up close to the edge as you can okay that's that side okay and that's oh here's one right here close to the edge as you can I stayed in that line of that. With that, we're gonna put it close to the edge as we possibly can. Close to the edge as we possibly can. y'all look y'all look what we did with this box now you know what we can do we can also add another color you can keep going on and on and on and on with this here box for its colors and so forth you can alright so by just looking at the box just by looking at the box, everyone. By just looking at the box of this right here. And we did this. See? And y'all see right here what I was telling y'all about? Right there. Y'all can add another piece of this right here same color or a different color you, we can add green to this if we wanted to or we can just keep it like as a theme color and use that right there that piece like i say i would go around with my heat and do like this then melt all the rest of it down shake all the extra off so you won't have that string everywhere you can also put something right here you in like it's for a kid you can put like a little sand for this now you have a cute little box see you have a cute little box let me show y'all let me show y'all what i was talking about where i can move down close with my camera y'all see i'm glad i got this camera i got like an investment made a little investment sometimes you have to do that y'all see that now Like I said, you can also put a sand right here. Now, you have a box. You have a blinged out box compared to what it looked like before. From this to this. From this right here. Nothing's on it to this. I left this here piece off because you still want to be able to open it up like this. Like that. Okay. Like I say, I have to put some heat to that and shh, go around, add you a cute little pin. Baby, you can also have, you can do a blue theme with this. You can do a green. You can do a lavender. You can do a, 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 a white or either you can do like a cream color beige or whatever. You can do a whole total set with this yes you can guys you can do a whole total set with this yep sure can look tell me that does not look nice it does see what I could could have did I could have came right here put me a little piece right here and put another little piece right there and like I say, I could have added another color to it. And if I wanted to add green to it, I could have very well did that. But I don't think I wanted to add the green because I didn't do the green thing. You see what I'm saying? So if I had to, I'd go back with the magenta color and put it right there. 
I wouldn't put it on the sides. I just do it right here at the front. That way it won't make it look like it's a big gap right there. But leave this here open. Right there. I wouldn't do the sides like I said. And I'll probably put a piece back there. To go with the box. So like I said, y'all pay attention to some of the stuff that we're doing. Y'all don't know if it'll be in the giveaway or not. Y'all don't know in our next giveaway. I'm not sure. Like I say, this here, you can just cover this up. Put you a piece of felt, whatever theme you color you're using. Get you a color piece. Put it back there on the back. Mm -hmm. To cover this up. That way when you do set it down, it's not moving like I said. But that is that with that. And that is this with this. Like I said, you can leave it. You can do it like this. Leave it plain. And you can also doctor these up as well. You know, you can cover this up. Paint it. Whatever you want to do. Put some bling over it. Or put another pick over it. Or either you can put some sticky paper um, over it. They redo the whole book in something blue if you want it to. You can do the whole different thing if you want it to. This another whole set right there. Like I say guys, decorate them. You can alter them. Now if I me personally I will keep going with this. I will definitely keep going with this. Because I add me some pictures or something. They'll find me a cute little pic. I can do like a little ice cream theme. I have I have some um ice cream stickers. I can put an ice cream sticker there if I was giving it to a kid or whatever. And make sure they have a little pen. They, will, they love stuff like that. I know what I'm talking about because I have sold several of these right here when it's time to go back to school guess what the moms don't have to buy it because i do like a giveaway for school and i do and they don't have to buy it it's just a giveaway they'll have the whole theme set everything they have this they have the pen they other journals they'll have a y'all just don't know just a bundle total bundle but this is how you can decorate these boxes okay so don't sleep on your boxes and stuff on your um sticky note boxes if you don't like the theme just redeck just alter them that's all you got to do just alter it'll work it'll work Look. it would definitely work it would definitely work guys trust me like I say, you can also do it in beads too. But use your adhesive. With I would use my adhesive with the beads depending on what it is. If I use the glue, it it just depends on how much glue you put with it, okay? That's what I do. But that is it, guys, for this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure your post notification bell is on so you don't miss a video anytime it's the upload over here at Closet Says. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And your subscribe button, what? Gray and not red, guys. Make sure your subscribe button is gray and not red. And like the video. So Miss D can definitely keep bringing y'all this content. And I also have some other items to share with you guys. So I hope you got something out of this video. So if you have these little boxes and stuff like this laying around. Find you some cute sticky notes. Um, um, to put in them. And then find you some sticky paper to go on top of it. If you don't like the theme color. If, but this here, you can very well leave the same because it's cute by itself. You can do like a whole set. Plain, one decorated, and so forth. You can just keep it going. Whatever you decide to do with it. But I'm telling you, if you do a lot of DIYs and stuff like that. And you alter a lot of stuff. I'm telling you, this is... they. I'm telling you, they're into stuff like this. That's just like a plain pen. Y'all already know how we do the pins. Why, why we can't do the same thing to this? Because we can. All right. 
I'm going to leave the rest to you guys. And I'm out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel.